So, here is part three, or what we can now say the final part of the um, makeover of the 2000 Chevrolet conversion van, high top luxury. So, I was unable to get what I was able to get installed, to film what I was able to get installed into the van, but I'm going to show you the aftermath now. So, here we have a new, newly installed stereo that I got at Sound Concept. Let's turn on the van just a little bit. Alright, and the radio comes on. This is to lower your volume. This is to up the volume. And this is for the, the home on the touch screen, which I'm going to show you in a minute. This button needs to play and pause, BT, and uh, if you wanted to listen to your radio, you would have to turn your car up all the way. So let's open this up, screen pops up, you can put your DVD player in there. This is also for your Bluetooth, so if you have your phone, then it's not going to come out. It shows you the correct time. This one right here is for your home. You have your tuner for the station. You can set your station or listen to what you want to listen. Or if the radio is not playing when you're driving, you can just set that up. Make sure you're listening to whatever tune you want to listen. If it's a newscast, a uh, sports broadcast or something, you just set that up and then close the screen if you want to. We also have, you also have iPod audio, US USB audio, uh, disc audio. And this is also for the, here. there's also things for the rear um, but um, nothing really here to show you can also slide up uh, slide pages so you can do this there's cameras that you can use if you're gonna use like a rear camera and there's also um, auxiliary 1 auxiliary 2 iPod video USB video disk video you also have your GPS navigation and this also has a Bluetooth, so you can hook up your uh, um, iPhone to it. So if you just put if you put in a disc, everything's just gonna go up, and then you're gonna be able to play your DVD, and then you can listen to your um, you can you can watch your movie while you're driving. This right here is a magnet that you can use to hook up your cell phone with it. This is like a GPS hookup. Um, let's turn this off. Oh, let's leave it off for a little bit. So this is a, a magnet, like a magnet magnet attacher for your phone if you're going to use it for like a GPS or something, or if you just want to put your phone right here for a little bit to set up what well, you want to set up for like the screen, whatnot. All right, we're going to close this. Also, we have a DVD player. Which I finally got installed. This one is hooked up right to the TV. Let's turn it on. I still have the remote for the TV, but it's right there. I ha might have to put it back here in the seat. Let's do that. Or I'll hold this up for a little bit. So the TV takes a little bit de delayed to load up. Let's turn on the DVD. It is a little hard to see. You can barely see it, but this is the power button right here. There it is, and also, and also, yep, the t the 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 D the TV is working. So I have extra storage right here. So right there, you can, if you can't see it, that is your power. That is the 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 play and pause button, the stop button, the the rewind or skip whatever DVD be select and eject and also I got some hooks for the hanger or the the this um, curtain to close up I have to move the seats up just a little bit so turn that off and the remote I don't know if it works it doesn't really quite work but so I'm gonna put the remote right in here. Also, 
we have a garbage can installed so what I use is velcro so I've installed it on the flat parts of the of the of the garbage can we, you can move that up and install your gar and put your garbage in there and also I also installed this uh, this small cooler with velcro and and I can put in a drink in it put drinks in it if I want push that button and then it just opens if you don't know what button I'm talking about I'm talking about this so let's close that up this is this button is more like a lock so you just press that and it opens it's good enough for about eight drinks and then you can put some ice in it and again it has velcro so it's gonna so it's it sticks well to the rug it stick well to the rug but the, the rug is a little bit of a pull up but I don't know I don't know if it I don't think it's gonna fall up or whatnot I'll just be careful going around uh, curbs oh man it's still on let's turn this off okay all right for the back right here we have we have the we have the drawers that I can use for accessories and clothes and I have storage up here and um, I, I have still have like this kind of like storage right here I don't I'm planning on putting my DVDs in there but I don't know if they're gonna fit and I also have this shirt hanger or clothes hanger whatever you want to call it what I'm probably gonna do in the future is that if I want to bring extra clothes or my costumes I can just put it up right here and I'm also still planning to put my bean bag back here just hoping it fits all the way and um, so this drawer right here is for if I wanted to bring my camera or anything extra the other three down here are for my clothes so one two three and I also have velcro right on right on the wall over there and I know what you're probably gonna ask now um, well how are you gonna keep the drawers from sliding out well for one the bean bag if it has enough space to um, to fit right across then it should be able to hold up all the drawers and everything and if everything I know if everything is if anything is heavy it's not going to be heavy enough to um hold in the drawers so I can I'm, I'm either going to use that or use some tape and I also made sure that this bed will be able to fit down presses up against my leg every time I gotta move a little bit and there we go so I have to leave this lie down if I'm gonna put the if I'm gonna put the bean bag right across and make sure it fits all the way and make sure it doesn't cause any damage oh I also gotta move these seats up a little bit that there I don't know if I moved it up good enough yeah I did the best I could and also what I'm gonna use the beanbag for is a pillow so I can be able to reach down all the way back so and um, I'm also I have to just like move the seat up so um let me flip that over so right here you have your switches for the up oh, oh, oh right, there they are right there so these are the switches for your um, seat on the front this is to lower the seat this one right here and this is to adjust it if you wanted to lay back or anything and this is just to scoot it up I'm also gonna scoot this one up just a little bit and so what I'm also gonna just add is just some bags to the garbage can ice and drinks into the cooler make sure this thing is all ready to go hopefully and then hopefully I have a perfect van all set so now this van is all set and ready to go and I also still have the curtain right there right there in that pocket to put up for the put up for the door right there that's open right now 
So that just about does it for this van. It's a conclusion of the makeover. And also, that's also the remote for the DVD player. So anyways, guys, that is the makeover complete of the van. What I plan to get sometime soon is a dash cam to put like right up there. I've seen it on sale by road cams, which seem pretty good, and they seem to be in HD. So they also do sell them at Best Buy. I understand, but they see, but the that's but the road, but the ca dash cam sold by road cam seems more legit. Well, not that it's not legit, but it seems more HD and all that. So I'm gonna get that probably in about a couple weeks. Well, maybe neither next week or two, and. Um, and then that's how I'm going to be able to do more travel vlogs in the future more properly. I don't know if my phone's going to be able to film when I can. It's not going to really have a perfect view or anything. Unless if I just bring my GoPro or anything. But anyways, um, stay tuned for my vlog coming up pretty soon this week. And I hope you guys enjoyed the makeover. And I hope you guys like this van. And prepare to go on a road trip with me, guys. And if you, want, and if you come across me, if you want to ride on my van, you're more than welcome. But I'm, but I'm just hoping it's a legit trip. But anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching. Please remember to like, comment, subscribe. This is Mark Galloway signing out.